How to get rid of mothball smell in your house, detailed guide. Are you tired of walking into your home only to be greeted by the overwhelming scent of mothballs? Does the thought of inviting guests over make you cringe because you know they'll smell it too? Well, fear not my odor afflicted friend. In this video, we'll guide you on how to get rid of mothball smell in your house. So, you can breathe easily and confidently invite company over for dinner or at least not feel embarrassed about the smell. But first, what are the tools and materials you'll need to complete this task? For the full list and where to get them, check the description and pinned comment below. Now that you have all your tools and materials ready, let's get rid of that awful smell. Get rid of it! Identify the source of the smell. This is important because it will help you determine which areas of your house you need to clean or treat. Here are some steps you can take to identify the source of the smell. The first thing you should do is check if there are still mothballs in your house. If you find any, remove them and dispose of them properly. You can put them in a sealed plastic bag and throw them in the trash. Make sure to wash your hands thoroughly after handling them. Next, identify the areas where the mothballs were stored. Mothballs are often placed in closets, drawers, or storage containers. Check these areas to see if you can find any remaining mothballs or if there is any mothball residue left behind. Your clothing, linens, upholstery, and other porous materials can absorb mothball odor. Therefore, check these items to see if they have a strong odor. You can also try smelling around the house to see if there are any areas where the smell is particularly strong. For example, if you notice a strong smell coming from your closet, your clothes have likely absorbed the mothball odor. Once you've identified the source or sources of the smell, you can now take the next steps. Clean affected items. When trying to get rid of the mothball smell in your house, it's important to also address any items that may have absorbed the odor. Here are some steps to follow for cleaning affected items. Sort through all items in the affected area and separate washable and non-washable items. Wash any washable items, such as clothing, linens, and curtains, in the washing machine with your regular detergent. Consider adding a cup of white vinegar to the wash cycle to help neutralize the smell. For non-washable items such as furniture, use a damp cloth and a solution of equal parts white vinegar and water to wipe down the surfaces. Test a small, inconspicuous area first to make sure the solution doesn't damage the item. For items that are too large or difficult to move, consider using baking soda to help remove the odor. Simply sprinkle baking soda over the affected items and then let it sit for two to three hours. During this period, the baking soda will absorb the mothball smell. After that, vacuum up the soda from the items. Ensure that you vacuum up all the baking soda. Using baking soda in this manner can be effective for items such as carpets, rugs, and upholstery. Allow all cleaned items to air dry completely before returning them to the affected area. Some items may require multiple rounds of cleaning to completely remove the mothball smell. Therefore, you need to be patient and persistent when carrying out this process. Air out the house. The first step to airing out your house is to open all the windows and doors. Doing this will create a cross breeze that can help move the stagnant air out of your house. If you have ceiling fans or portable fans, turn them on to improve ventilation. Fans can help move the air around and increase the airflow in your house. This, in turn, can help remove unwanted odors. Make sure to position the fans so that they are blowing air toward the open windows or doors. If the weather outside is not conducive to opening windows and doors, turn on the air conditioner or heater. These systems can help circulate the air in your home and remove unwanted smells. Set the system to the fan mode to improve ventilation, rather than relying on the cooling or heating function. In some cases where the mothball smell is not severe, airing out your house will eliminate the odor. However, if the smell persists, try the next method. Use activated charcoal. Activated charcoal is a highly porous material that can absorb and trap unwanted odors. It's also non-toxic. So, 
you don't have to worry about the release of harmful chemicals into your home. To get the best results, use activated charcoal that comes in small pellets or granules. These forms are easy to handle and can be easily placed in a container. Once you have your activated charcoal, place it in a container. Then, position the container in the room where the mothball odor is strongest. You can use a small bowl, jar, or container to hold the activated charcoal. If the odor is strong, use multiple containers of activated charcoal throughout the affected area. This will help increase the amount of charcoal available to absorb the odor. It will also speed up the process of getting rid of the smell. Leave the activated charcoal for two to three days before replacing it. This is important because, after a while, the charcoal will get saturated with the absorbed odor. When that happens, the product will be unable to absorb any more. Keep replacing the activated charcoal until the smell is eliminated. You'll need to be patient as this process may take several weeks or even months to work. The duration depends on the severity of the mothball odor and the size of the affected area. Use baking soda or coffee grounds. Baking soda is a natural odor absorber and can help absorb unwanted odors like mothball smell. It's safe, effective, and non-toxic. Therefore, you don't have to worry about the release of any harmful chemicals into your home. We recommend that you purchase a baking soda product that comes in a large box or bag. This will ensure that you have enough to fill several bowls. Once you have your baking soda, fill several bowls with it. Then, place the bowls throughout the affected rooms. Be sure to place the bowls in areas where the mothball odor is strongest. For example, you may want to place a bowl of baking soda in each corner of the room. Replace the baking soda every few days until the odor dissipates. This is important because, over time, the baking soda will become saturated with the absorbed odor. When that happens, its effectiveness will be reduced. Replacing the product allows you to combat the smell until it is eliminated. The period required to get rid of the smell depends on how severe the odor is. In some cases, it may take several weeks or even months for the odor to completely dissipate. If the mothball odor is particularly strong, use multiple bowls of baking soda throughout the affected area. This will help increase the amount of baking soda available to absorb the odor. As a result, this will speed up the process of getting rid of the smell. You can also use coffee grounds instead. Coffee grounds are also great natural odor absorbers. For the best results, ensure that you use dry and fresh coffee grounds. Although you can also use used coffee grounds, they may not be as effective at absorbing the odor. The process of using coffee grounds is the same as baking soda. You only need to be cautious about using coffee grounds if you have pets. They can be harmful to pets if ingested. Therefore, always keep the bowls of coffee grounds out of the reach of pets. If you can't manage this, avoid using coffee grounds. Use vinegar and water. Vinegar is a natural deodorizer and can help neutralize unwanted odors like mothball odor. Keep in mind that vinegar has a strong odor of its own. However, the odor will dissipate once you wipe away the solution. To use vinegar and water, start by mixing equal parts of white vinegar and water in a spray bottle. For example, you can mix one cup of white vinegar with one cup of water. Shake the bottle well to ensure that the vinegar and water are thoroughly mixed. Once you have your vinegar and water solution, spray it in the affected rooms. You can also spray it on items that may have absorbed the mothball smell. Be sure to spray the solution evenly and thoroughly. Ensure that you cover all surfaces the odor may have affected. After spraying the solution, allow it to sit for 15 to 20 minutes. During this time, the vinegar will help to neutralize the odor. After 15 to 20 minutes, use a clean cloth to wipe away the solution. Be sure to wipe away all residue of the solution. This is important as vinegar can leave a strong odor of its own if left to dry on surfaces. Depending on the severity of the mothball odor, you may need to repeat the process several times to completely get rid of the smell. If the odor persists after the first application, simply repeat the steps until the odor is gone. Use essential oils. 
Essential oils are a popular natural remedy for many things, including getting rid of unwanted odors. They not only neutralize mothball odor, but they also leave a pleasant scent behind. There are many different essential oils to choose from, each with its unique properties and scents. Some popular essential oils for getting rid of odors include lavender, lemon, and peppermint. Next, mix a few drops of your chosen essential oils with water in a spray bottle. The amount of essential oil you use will depend on how strong you want the scent to be. You can experiment with different amounts to find what works best for you. Spray the solution in the affected rooms and on any items that have absorbed the mothball odor. Be sure to spray in areas where the odor is strongest. The essential oils will help neutralize the odor and leave a pleasant scent behind. Allow the solution to sit for 15 to 20 minutes before wiping it away with a clean cloth. This will give the essential oils time to absorb the odor and neutralize it. If the mothball odor is particularly strong, reapply the essential oil solution several times. You can also mix up a fresh batch of the solution as needed. If you have a diffuser, you can also use it to disperse essential oils throughout the affected area. When using essential oils, it's important to remember that they are highly concentrated. So, always use them with caution. Be sure to dilute the essential oils with water before using them. Furthermore, avoid using them directly on your skin or ingesting them. Essential oils can be harmful to pets. Therefore, keep them out of the reach of pets. If you can't manage that, use a different method. Use an air purifier. Using an air purifier is another effective way to help get rid of the mothball smell in your home. Here's how to use an air purifier. Choose an air purifier that is appropriate for the size of the room you want to purify. Look for an air purifier with a HEPA filter. These filters are designed to capture small particles such as the chemicals in mothballs. Place the air purifier in the affected rooms where the mothball smell is strongest. Make sure to position it away from walls and furniture to allow for maximum airflow. Turn on the air purifier and run it continuously until the odor dissipates. Depending on the severity of the odor, this may take several days or even weeks. Replace the filter in the air purifier as directed by the manufacturer. This will help ensure that the air purifier is functioning properly and capturing as many odor-causing particles as possible. If the odor persists after trying the above methods, consider hiring a professional to get rid of the smell. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you liked it and found it useful. If so, please like, share, and comment to let me know what you thought. Your feedback is important to me. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos.